بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم We are now in a test. Now we are in a test. And test is affecting our comfort zone. Alhamdulillah, none of us are sick. Alhamdulillah. But our comfort zone is gone. We don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. I don't know if um, we're going to go to work tomorrow. I don't know what will happen. They close the schools. What about Ramadan? We'll be able to come for Tarawih. We said don't. Are we going for Hajj? All these for us as Muslims. Can we go for the wedding? Right? We don't know. Things are so uncertain that I really need to start using everything I can. And Allah gave me to combat that. To combat that. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also said in Surah Al-Anbiya, وَلَنَبْلُوَنَّكُمْ بِالشَّرِّ وَالْخَيْرِ فِتْنَةِ وَإِلَيْنَا تُرْجَعُونَ We will test you. You will be tested. By good. He said first by evil and by good. This is a test from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is how I look at it. It's called Corona. It is called SARS. It is called flu. It is called whatever it is called. He allowed it to happen. And he sent it. What should I do? I'm going to say it again. You have a full yaqeen that Allah is the only one who's going to remove it. And the only one who will protect you. And will protect this earth. Number one. Number two. Dua. Dua, turn to him, sincere, in your sujood, in your night salah, in when, if it is raining, during the rain, any time when you are so afraid, so afraid, let's say you are in your co-worker and the co-worker was tested positive, may Allah protect everybody, when you're getting so scared, that's the dua where it's going to be granted, inshallah. Number three, a lot of istighfar, a lot of good deeds and repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Number five, You take the means to prevent it by dunya means. So don't say, I, I relied on Allah, I'm going to start shaking hands. I relied on Allah, I'm going to be coughing. That's not my deen. Because...